Well, it's January 14th. I think it's a Sunday. And we are just outside of Titusville, Florida. Camped out right alongside the road, right in the road easement. Um, on the way out to the Cape Canaveral is just down the road. And I think it's Parishville, Parish Park. I'm not sure. But what's really cool about this place is, um, well, take a look at this. How cool is that? And if we zoom in, that is the VAB building, NASA. And right about there is the Falcon Heavy. It's going to go up in about three or four hours. And we're parked right alongside the road. How cool is that? It didn't go up last night. It delayed for high winds. Kind of thought that would happen. So I spent the night on the side of the road, free campsite. Got up this morning and I'm parked right outside the entrance of the Cape Canaveral Wildlife Refuge. So I got up this morning and thought I'd start driving around the uh, wildlife refuge. And that's what we're doing this morning. It's uh, Titusville over there. And I can't get into my reservation up at Flagler Beach until 3 p.m. It's about 7, eh, almost 8 o'clock this in the morning now. So we got a day to kill. So I thought we'd drive around a bit. Right into the sun. But really, truth be told, this is more my speed. A lonely little road, some scenic views. Let's go see where this road goes. Oh, that's probably why they call it a wildlife refuge. Look at all those birds. Let's follow the birds. Bopping around Merritt Island, 
the uh, National Wildlife Refuge and found the National Seashore. We're uh, just north of the Kennedy Space Center. You can see the Atlantic Ocean behind me here rolling in. Kind of a chilly 45 degree day. Got the beach to myself. It's supposed to warm up into the 70s here in the next few days. But if you take a look to the south, the Kennedy Space Center. That's the Falcon Heavy that was supposed to go up last night. Should go up tonight around 5.30. Of course, I'm going to be up about 20, 30 miles north of here, up at Flagler Beach. Had a really cool spot last night, 12 miles away, but winds were too high. There's some fishermen down there on the beach. Pretty much got the place to myself. At least this section of beach. Peaceful little area.